I was drowning, guys. I'm not even gonna lie, I was drowning, like. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title, today I'm gonna be doing my year two review. Just gonna be giving a little update on how I'm finding uni, how I'm finding Birmingham, and yeah, just how year two was. Obviously the background's a bit different because I'm at home on my couch which I think is a good place to be like it's sort of like a sit down let's unpack it sort of thing um sort of video so yeah I'm gonna try and not wobble for too long um just keep it very concise and stuff and I also think it's very important for me to do this video because I realized in my year one review like I made it sound so bad like I had people message me and ask me if I regret it and I was like damn like i made it sound that bad but honestly like i don't hate Birmingham, but I'm not gonna lie i don't love it either but you know that's besides the point so i'll get into it in this in this video so starting off with birmingham as a city i don't hate birmingham i don't love it like i'm just sort of in the middle i'm like i'm here it's cool sort of thing in terms of the transport i don't mind the trains i think i mentioned this in my last video i don't mind the trains I've had times where like i've been waiting for the bus and it actually doesn't turn up so that's just one thing that sort of irritates me and also the fact that I'm gonna have to like depend on the bus for placement next year sort of just worries me a bit I can't have the bus not coming when I need to be at placement for nine like that cannot happen x21 x22 those are usually okay but as for some of the other buses I don't know they just I don't know and as i said i moved a bit closer to city center which i am personally more comfortable with i like the area more i think it's partially to do with like the walking so where i lived last year i was walking 20 25 minutes to uni every day and even though technically i lived closer to uni i'm personally not big on walking like that so i'd rather just move and i can like get a train whether it's like five ten minutes and get there where I'm not sweating. For me, that's what I personally prefer, but obviously to each their own. I enjoy the area that I live in more. And I think that's why I sort of enjoyed second year a little bit more because of that. But again, there's nothing wrong with living near campus. A lot of people prefer to live near to uni, which is completely understandable. There's a whole lot of benefits of living near to uni. That's one thing that I feel like improved for me this year. Where I lived. So moving on to more about UOB and uni and the course and stuff. So as you guys will know, second year the work is it's on a different level. Like when everyone tells you that the work in second year just goes up, it does. And I really felt that, especially um this last semester, so summer term, that is when the work just I was drowning guys i'm not even gonna lie i was drowning like it was so much i would go to placement like my placement um tutor she was so nice so like whenever we would go to placement she would just um we would just talk she would just let us like rant about medical school i would say to her like i feel like you know those videos yeah when they throw babies like they're teaching babies how to swim and then they throw them in the water so that they can like float i feel like i wasn't floating like it just felt like i was drowning every single time eventually it did obviously like my fluid because i'm still hearing it but you know it just felt like that a couple of times and i'm not gonna lie if anyone found second year easy then hats off to them but as for me and for a lot of other people it does get hard and you do have to really have your sort of well-being mechanisms in place and like know where you're gonna go for help and stuff because the workload doubles like the stress doubles like everything just doubles yeah and you just it, it gets a bit much sometimes so um that is like my honest opinion about second year but that's not to say that i didn't have a lot of things that i enjoyed about second year and there were a lot of like people that i met and things that i did that i really did enjoy so yeah it wasn't all bad so i don't want you guys to think what like i don't want you guys to take my personal opinion and think that it's completely like horrible for every bad thing there's at least one good thing it's not all bad guys okay so i don't regret 
doing medicine don't regret coming to uob at school like none of that just giving you guys the honest truth you know so so in terms of socializing and all that stuff um so for this year i actually joined the acs committee so i was creative director for that so i obviously like was going to the events that we hosted and stuff so i was meeting um a lot of new people and i made a lot of new friends as well so i'd say that the socializing aspect was still okay for me i know that the some people it is much harder to you know like make new friends in second year for some people they don't want to make new friends which is fine i will say obviously still you know go out there and like go to events and it's really important to diversify your network i think um and i met like a, a lot of valuable people this year you know just from just essentially going to new places and stuff so um i'll definitely say you know don't close yourself off in second year you'll probably make friends that you didn't think you would make i am actually very shy so if you're like me like i can understand you know the feeling but um the more people you talk to you like the easier it gets and stuff like, what i'm gonna say is don't close yourself off in second year obviously you know still focus on your work because second year actually counts towards your degree so don't just be out here doing who knows what all the time but um still go out and um socialize build valuable connections because you will need a network for sure in second year i think linking back to ats i wanted to talk about motives yeah because i was on the committee like a couple, we went to a motive cmr a couple of times and it got to a point yeah where i was just like this is so boring i don't know if i hate the clubs but it was just not maybe it was just i think it's just the event that i was going to like it was just getting so boring like it got to a point yeah where i could predict the songs and the sequence that they were going to be played in like i just felt like some of the djs were not even trying with their sets anymore like it just got so dry i didn't even go to that many events like i think i went to maybe two or three in first semester and by the third one i was predicting all of the songs chancia doesn't only have one hit you go there they're just playing the same songs every single time maybe because it's i'm because i'm second year now and like i've been to a couple motives in first year and so i kind of got used to it but it's just like you know i'm gonna play any new music like you know switch up the playlist it was getting dry it was getting dry maybe i don't like it anymore maybe it's just not for me but it's just yeah i think i went to like one or two very good very good motives and then after that it was just like nah nah i just wanted to talk about that because it just i don't know if anyone else feels that way but it just was so i was not feeling it anymore so the next bit is sort of more med related so um i kind of mentioned it a bit earlier in the video but second year the work doubles okay in terms of the difference between second semester of first year and first semester of second year um it sort of is similar but second semester it was just it was a lot like i was revising for my exams for second year um second semester of this year and i was like i'm not gonna finish with this content and i actually for some of it i actually didn't um it's by the grace of god that i passed this set of exams because like i don't think i finished all of it maybe that was partially on my part like i could have maybe organized like revision a bit better or maybe i should have started a bit earlier but i don't know like it was so much work so much content i should say i felt like i was being thrown in the deep end of the pool like but like i can't swim you'll be fine honestly yeah like everyone was complaining and most of us are all right i say most because i can't speak for everyone like i don't know um i don't know exactly how everyone in the year is doing but you will be fine like if you're studying med and you're going into second year to be fair everyone does say that this is second year is what well, at you would be at least that second year is probably one of the worst years so i'll pass on the message that if you can get get through second year you will be fine i'm hoping i don't want to get to third year and then it's like even more treacherous but <laughs> and when you guys to watch my videos and like be whatever be worried about stuff it's literally just me trying to be like honest like i don't want to ever sugarcoat anything so when you watch this video like obviously take it with a pinch of salt because you might get to second year and you might be like oh this is easy like what was she talking about um and if you feel like that then that is absolutely great 
but you know for a lot of people it didn't feel like that and that's fine as well so yeah that's all i can say um just be prepared i think and just pace yourself i'm um, not that i wasn't doing that but just like there were moments yeah where i'm not gonna lie like i was kind of just chilling when i should have been working but at the same time it's like you can't be 24 7 working because then you get burnt out and that's not good for anything but it's all a learning process um i think that's what i can say with my course it's like obviously i plan ahead and stuff but kind of just learning to take it as it comes and like jump over the hurdles as i reach them that's just my personal take but second year it's hard but you can get through it and it will be fine the last thing i want to talk about is finances so i think this is important to mention because obviously cost of living has shot through the roof okay it got to a point yeah where i had to make like a spreadsheet like i went on notion and i made like this spreadsheet of jobs that i'm gonna apply to because i was like bro like i can't be i can't live like this it was hard i'm not gonna lie but that's just me personally obviously like i'm doing better now being a uni student anyways or like moving to a different city is already expensive so you can just imagine during cost of living how it is i managed to get some tuition clients this year um that was really good for me because it was you know flexible and um i could work it around my schedule and stuff so that was probably one of the best things and then obviously now like i'm working over the summer so i'm sort of building up my pot for next year which is something that i didn't do last year i sort of left it a bit too late you know didn't really work enough so so definitely work over the summer is my main takeaway you don't probably know that already but please get a job and you know start doing it like start thinking about your jobs from like january february thinking about what you're gonna try and do over the summer to get your money up try and find something during the semester if you can manage it of course um that is flexible works on your studies and yeah cost of living is really out here doing the most doing the most but yeah guys that's all i really wanted to say about second year I feel like all i've really said is that it's so hard but honestly it's something that you can get through and i learned a lot about myself about finances about you know just life in general during second year like it was very much character building so it's like would i do it again you'd have to pay me probably double my student finance to do that but did i learn a lot from it absolutely use my experience as a learning point sort of so it won't be all bad you'll have good moments during second year it was a lot of fun we're hoping that you do you know like being with my friends and all that stuff was great so don't worry about it too much don't stress about it too much there will be like uncertainties that come at you and things that you didn't expect but you can absolutely get through those okay so yeah i think this is a bit better than my first year review first year i feel like in the first year i was very frustrated um for a number of reasons so that's why i was kind of just like i was basically saying i hated it but <laughs> i didn't hate it at all honestly um it was great uni is great most of the time <laughs> but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i hope this video was useful to you any questions comment them but don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video